Now out of their dorms due to a bat infestation, NAU students and parents say off-campus living has come with complications. With bats swarming, NAU students were left scrambling. Parents got very little communication. The kids were getting chaotic communication. Matt Allison had heard about the bats in his son's dorm. Then he visited and saw them for himself. I call him Bruce. You know, I walked in, I go, oh, Bruce is hanging up, you know, from Batman, Bruce Wayne. Last Thursday, in the middle of midterms, he says these health notices went on students' doors. Then on Friday, every student was told to move out. I, I think we did it about 10 hours. Allison says the move was time intensive and costly. And he's struggling to get refunds for things like parking passes and meal plans. Kids have got, have paid 700 bucks for parking and they, they no longer have parking. Now off campus in Flagstaff, he says the new accommodations aren't even across the board. His kid has his own room in a newly built apartment. Others, like sophomore Julian Herrera, are still sharing a room with a roommate and a common space with a man in his 30s. He's not like a huge problem. It's just weird because it wasn't like we're living with like another student. It was like someone who's going to work. Parents also tell me they're concerned about their students' physical health after they lived alongside these bats for a number of days. That's because with bats come bat droppings represented by these sprinkles here. And when these are moved around, spores come out and those spores can lead to respiratory illness. When I asked, NAU said they didn't background check people living alongside these students. And they were notified of a captured bat in early September, but no bats inside dorms before. Do you think the school knew there was a bat infestation before move-in day? Yeah, because my son was seeing bats last year dead on the ground. NAU officials tell us they have reached out to students regarding the refund process. Adam Mitzer, ABC 15, Arizona.